Yeah. Mm. I've just given the police another ring. And? Nothing. Well, they did say they'd have more joy looking out of this daylight. Yeah, well, they were hardly interested last night, were they? You know that's not true, Mum. You heard what he said. He said most kids usually turn up after there's been around. Now, come on. Yeah, well, anything could have happened to him, couldn't it? Oh, well, I'm going to start looking. Now, Ruth's going to go over to the laundrette and do your shift for you, but I think you'd better stay here. Just in case he turns up, yeah? Mum? Try not to worry too much. Sam. All right. Do us a favour, will you? Yeah. If anyone asks, just tell her I'm setting up late today. Is everything all right, Mark? No, not really. Martin's gone missing. What? Just keep this between ourselves, with you? I don't want anyone else finding out. All right. Mum's upset enough as it is. Yeah. Hey, you, uh, you sure you don't need any help? Don't worry. I'll find them. by the allotments last night, and I'm sure I saw someone going to Arthur's shed. Didn't really think much about it. Cheers, Nigel. Stay away from me. You're safe. Thank God. You're not taking the stuff. Is it in the shed? Look, Martin. Look, I'll do a deal with you, OK? If you come home with me now, you can keep the stuff in there for the rest of the day, and we'll talk about it later, all right? I don't want another scene like last night, do you? Oh, come on, Martin, please. Your mum's sick with worry. She just wants to know that you're safe and well, that's all. You're not the only one that's been in trouble, you know. What do you mean? Exactly what I say. I've been there, too. Only I let things get so bad that I was sent away. Liar! It's true. I spent some time in a detention centre. Why? What did you do? Burglary. Assaulting a police officer. How come I never knew? Because Mum didn't want you to. And I can't say that I blame her. It's nothing that I'm proud of, Martin. It was awful. Being locked up and having your freedom taken away from you. It's the worst punishment anyone can have. I don't want to see the same thing happen to you. I couldn't bear it. When I came home, do you know the one thing that put me back on track? It was Mum, Dad, Gran and Michelle. Even though I tried to shut them out, they still stood by me. That was the only thing that got me through in the end. I'm trying to help me. I'm on your side, believe me. Where on earth have you been? It's okay, Mummy's home now. That's all the matter. Yeah, never mind. We've been up all night, worried, sick. We've even had the police out looking for you. What'd you call them for? Well, because you could have been lying in a ditch somewhere for all we knew. I could look after myself. Can't yeah, I? well, we want some answers from you, right? Martin, why don't you go and get yourself washed and ready for school? Mark, what are you playing at? Mum, leave it a minute. It's not going anywhere till I've got this all sorted Mom, out. Please, will you just sit down and I'll explain it to you? Right. Well, where was he? He's been hiding in Dad's shed all night. I thought the police looked there. And where's that bag? I didn't bring it. What do you mean you didn't bring it? Look, I got him to come home with me on the condition that the stuff stays in the shed, just for the time being. But that stolen property doesn't belong to him. Look, Mum, if you just listen to me, he's promised to come straight back after school and explain the whole lot to us. And you believe him? Oh, yes, I do. I think if we keep our side of the bargain, they'll keep his. Yeah, well, I don't want him going anywhere. I want him here, where I can keep an eye on him till we've got all this sorted out. What about Ethel? You went to go and see her later, aren't you? Yeah, but this is more important. Yeah, but Ethel's in a bad way, isn't she? You said so yourself. And Martin's safe. That's the main thing. And there's not much more we could do about it now, anyway, is there? I'll tell you what. I'll make sure he gets to school. And I'll get Ruth to collect him. Then we can all meet back here at tea time and talk through the whole thing, yeah? Why'd you go back on your word? 
Where's the bag? I'm talking to you, Martin. I thought we had a deal. It's okay, Martin. We just want to talk this thing through, that's all. You don't know much trouble, I mean, if I don't shop with it. I had to take it. Trouble? Who with? What are you on about? Mark, what's he on about? Will somebody tell me what's going on round here? Look, it's not my stuff. It belongs to the gang. I'm just one who's looking after it for him. Right, well, I've got to ask you now, for the last time, where is he? No, I'm not saying another word. You don't understand none of you! You come back here, I haven't finished no. with you yet! Oh. Oh, I've had enough. I can't take any more of this. What the hell have this gang got Martin into? Sounds like he's pulled his short straw, poor kid. What do you mean? Well, they offload all the stolen gear to him, and he's the one who's got to look after it. And if he doesn't? Well, he's in trouble, like he said. Mind you. If he's still got the stuff, I think he's safe. What, you mean they'll leave him alone then? Well, I don't think he's in any immediate danger, no. What are you talking about, danger? I don't want Martin in any sort of danger. He's just a kid. Well, then I think the best thing to do is let him keep all that stuff. Oh, this is all my fault. I know it is. Oh. How can you go and blame yourself for something like this? No, I should never have gone to America. I should have been here for him. Oh, thank Pauline. Come on, Martin's been through a hard time this year. I mean, we all have. It's going to have an effect on him. Are you trying to tell me there's a reason for all this, that it's not my fault? Yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying. Then can you explain to me how come that he got into trouble when he was a kid and Michelle goes and gets herself pregnant and ruins everything? How can you say that, Mum? Michelle's happy now. That's the most important thing, surely? Yes. And where is she? America. As far away from me as possible. First of all, you ran away, then she ran off. Now it's Martin. How long will it be before he goes? No, the truth is, is everything I touch just falls apart.